hey guys welcome back to my channel on this video I will be showing you guys how I store my washi tape so up here I have a huge basket from um, Hobby Lobby that I got on sale and it just has a lot of washi tapes in there and then I have two mason jars that I found at Joann's and this one has just random washi tapes and these have or this one has um, more skinny washi tape and there's that but the main um, storage system that I have is this clear um, are these clear containers that I found at Amazon they are meant for the coffee cups but I totally um, just got them and changed them for, or I didn't change them, but I used them for my washi tape collection. So the first drawer, as you guys can see, it opens nice and smooth. I broke this one on the move, but it still works. <laughs> and it lays your, um, your washi tape nice and uh, secured in here. So it has room, you know, to wiggle and move around, but other than that, your washi tape stays in place. So there's a first drawer. This is the second drawer or the second container. Um, and there's there you guys go. And you can fit any size of washi tape in here. Um, I have like from little washi tapes to um, more skinny washi tapes to more thicker washi tapes. So all your washi tapes are gonna fit in here. See, I have more skinny washi tapes here, and I have more little washi tapes here too. So they're all gonna fit. So there's that. And the good thing about these um, clear containers, I found them at Amazon, and um, I will be leaving the information down below in the description box so you guys can go check them out. I think they have them in black, green, and red. I think so um, but I got I chose a clear ones because let's say you just get one then you could totally just you know see your washi tape you don't have to go through each because um, I know they have another system for like the spice rack one and that one's a it's a white drawers um, but you know let's say you just wanted to know if you have um, a tree washi tape like right there you know so you just look and let me remove this basket so you just look for it and um, and then you see it really fast you're like okay I have it you know so you just open this drawer and take it out you don't have to like open all the drawers to see if you have um, a specific washi tape so I love these containers. I am going to uh, buy some more, maybe like two more or three more maybe depending on um, the amount of washi tapes I have there because I need to count. All right, so roughly you guys can fit, like for example on this drawer, I have 126 washi tapes. So roughly 126. Um, just it all depends on the size of your washi tapes but in this drawer I have hundred and twenty six washi tapes and a pen <laughs> and on this drawer so on each little um, divider you can fit one two three four five Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Like seventeen washi tapes. So seventeen washi tapes per um, little section. So seventeen times six. So that is like a hundred and two tapes per uh, drawer or per um, container. So that is a lot of washi tape, guys. On this one I have more, 126 I think I said, um, because these are like skinny washi tapes. So I fit, I was able to fit more in there. So 102 per container. So that is 100, 200, 300, and six 
washi tapes just on these three containers. That is a lot of washi tapes, guys. <laughs> I am obsessed with washi tape and I have more up there. So I will be getting some more jars. All right, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, please make sure to comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already. And give this video a thumbs up. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.